Hey friends, welcome back to my channel and today I have a Dollar Tree haul and then I also went to Michael's because I had a voucher to use and then I also received a Christmas card from Crafty or Crafter Deidre and I will leave her link down below so let's start with her card first. i um, not sure why it came so late because it was postmarked on the 28th but um, I got it so that's what's most important. Whoops. For some reason, that envelope got stuck to the card. All right. Whoops. Yeah. The card got messed up somehow, but that's okay. The envelope got stuck to it. But here is the card. It says season greetings. So thank you so much, girly. If you guys aren't familiar with her, she does um, Dollar Tree hauls. She does a lot of her journal shares, so um, if you're interested in all that, go check her out. So she put some little goodies in here. Here is a tag that she wrapped some washi trim samples. This one says Merry Christmas, the Christmas trees. This one's really pretty, this gold foiled. Thank you. And then, um, aw, these are cute. These are going in my Disney journal. Thank you. And then we have this one and this one. These are nice. I'm not sure if these were cut from a magazine, but those are cute, especially like during Christmas time. This would be cute for that. Thank you, my favorite princess. And we have some other like little um, cut aparts. Here is the truck. It, it feels like magazine. Like it was cut from a magazine and then, yeah, she just, um, wished me a Merry Christmas. And then this actually feels like a piece of, yep, yeah, it is. I was going to say wrapping paper. Oh, I wonder if this was all wrapping paper. It could have been. Yeah, it was. Gift wrap. Oh, that's cool. Thank you. Never thought about doing that. All right. Thank you so much, girly. So again, I will leave her link down below. Um, all right. So I went to Dollar Tree and if you have been watching, if you are watching Dollar Tree hauls, then you know that these are a new item. They are the, um, creative, creatively organized by chart. So it's a square shaped wire net. So these are great because you can just hang them anywhere. They're flat and you can um, hang things and it comes with the hardware so well not comes you have to buy it separate so they have like the rectangular shaped wire basket so um, I got two of these I'm not sure how I'm gonna set it up but I have a little spot in the craft room that I think this will fit if you guys know my craft room is not big but um, so any use of space is great so I picked up two of these like I mentioned now I know they have smaller baskets I think they are like maybe half the size I did not find those and I went to two Dollar Trees um, so one Dollar Tree didn't have any of this and the other one did and then I got this one here that's flat but if you have areas um, in your craft room that these can hang off of then you you, know, you don't want to use the wall piece you can just buy the baskets and use that you can hang this off a cart off another basket I know I have a coupled um, wired baskets because it has the loop here so technically don't need this if you don't want it um, but yeah this is an awesome awesome find and Dollar Tree is definitely stepping up their game when it comes to organization so I'm loving that all right so Moving along, I picked up these paper cups. They are um, super cute. I thought this would be nice just to kind of display on my little um, coffee bar. I don't really do a whole big setup for Valentine's, but I think this will be um, great to put there. And I've never seen these like for other holidays, so I'm excited that they brought those out. A um, couple like little Valentine beauty accessories. I found these. These are like all by the little um, stocking stuffers or gifts for Valentine's. And these are the nail files. I thought those would be cute just to add to um, Happy Mail. And then look at this is a nail, uh, like a foot file, Puma Stone. So I thought that was cool. So I thought that was cute. 
to pick up. Then I finally found this sign, and this was last year's sign, and it's the kissing booth. I love that it has no glitter, because when it comes to signs, I do not um, buy them because of the glitter. This one has none, so I'm excited about that. I'm going to be taking this off, and I'll probably add some um, blocks to the back. So it can just um, be like a tabletop decor. So loving that. Also found this gift tissue. It is the heart foiled. Now you only get six sheets, so probably not the best deal, but I can use this all year round. It does not have to be for Valentine's. And I thought it was a really pretty print for packaging purposes. Another sign that I was on the hunt for um, says love lives here. Again, no glitter. So I love this. It goes perfect for my home decor for Valentine's. They also had the other one that has this red, but it's not. See, I feel like this is, has a little bit of like pink purple tone to it versus this one. If the, if the other one was more like this red, I would have got it. But since it didn't, I just left it behind. But one is great. Um, a little bit random here. Um, I got this to keep at work. It's the Tropical Fruit Trail Mix. And they do come in individually packaged little bags. And it has four. So I'm assuming there's four pieces. Um, or four bags in here. So I thought that was a nice deal for uh, Dollar Tree. Finally found the Enwash Aroma Booster and Odor Eliminator. Um, the last person I saw haul this was Rosemary Z Rock Art, but I've seen so many people haul this. They cannot rave enough about it. These are supposed to be like the, um, like the, the downy, but they look like that. And they're, um, I believe there's a couple different scents. I just got this one, which is, I don't even know what scent I got, but it smells good. And it's a lot in here for $1.25, 17.5 ounces. Um, these are supposed to be like the rejects of the little um, booster beads of Downy. So, yeah, got two of those. I'm excited to try that out. Just picked up some Trident gum. I also got this. This is just for my grandma. For her arthritis. Oh, I also got this. The um, brushes. I don't need any more makeup brushes for myself. But I thought this would be cute to keep in the craft room. This is the biggest one that they had. And um, I use powder sometimes. Well, I use this brush here. Um, this is what I use to sometimes to remove the adhesive from stickers. If I want to just use them as an ephemera piece. And um, I don't know. And this is more like a duster that I can use here as well in the craft room. So got that one to keep here. I got this for work, a little teasing brush. I came across these, these are the insert card set and um, they have uh, mixtures of different colors. I just got this one, it's more light. They had some that had like dark red, but I just got this so I figured I can use these colors more often. I also picked up this. I thought it was cute. I do have like the little house that they came out with that has this print that I plan on using for some of my Valentine decor and I think this will match it so I'm just going to add like a red bow to this and then just use that as home decor kind of mix it in with my holiday or Valentine stash. The last two items from Dollar Tree I picked up these stickers because I know these are new for this year. Um, I'm not huge into gnomes, so I'll probably be adding this in a Happy Mail or a little giveaway. I'm not sure. And then also I found these. I have enough paper clips. I did not need to buy any. But I like the fact that they have the little star there. And I can add another dangle to that. So I can just clip this onto something and then add a little dangle to the paper clips. And those are um, rose gold in color. They also had um, two other set designs, I believe, in the paper clips. So that is all from Dollar Tree. And then I just have a couple things from Michael's. So I went there to use my, um, I just had like a $5 voucher. It wasn't a lot, but um, they had the Valentine stuff out, which was 30% off. So these are last year, I know for sure. So I just picked up another set because I like that it's a good size, small, and I have some embellishments I need to work on. 
Um, I did not pick these up, so I'm not sure if these are new, but I picked up two of these to, um, I believe, just gift in Happy Mail. These are new to me as well. They're like little mini garlands. So it's like um, out of like a cloth material and then it has glittered hearts. Also picked this up and I just like how it looks. It's very shimmery. I picked up two of these. I thought these would be cute to add in Happy Mail. The little heart tags. And then I also picked up two of these, Happy Valentine's Day. I saw Kelly G haul these, and um, she's going to be using them to do her Valentine cards. And um, I just picked up two for Happy Milk, because I don't really use stamp. And then last but not least, this is actually what I went for. These are like in their like little bins that they have by the register. And I needed an extra one of these. I have bought these before. And just needed one more so that was the reason why I went there to use my voucher and then I came out with that stuff they had um, like I said all their Valentine stuff out their paper pads they're all from last year I have them already so I did not need to buy any so that was kind of nice I wasn't peer pressured into uh, having to find <laughs> or buy another um, book paper pad anyway but yeah so this is my haul guys hope you enjoyed I will see you guys all in my next one take care bye